Hey everybody, welcome to the new video. This is Max from Sabu 133. So all the people who are looking out to basically do things which are monotonous without really putting in a lot of time and effort. So I'm going to actually teach you how to use the auto clicker for one of the activities. Now let me tell you, I have designed auto clicker for multiple things for the relics, for the Apple Wheel of Fortune, subordinate city hitting, opening boxes, researching, using speed ups. Uh, to add items to send somebody as a gift, to disassemble equipments, troop training, alliance science, trap training, everything, everything I have made all of these. Now these have been made by me, okay. So I'm not really going to share all of them in this one video because it is going to make you all lose your head. But what you can do is in the comment section, you can let me know what all things you would like to see and I can later on make a video for you. For now, I'm going to be just making one single and a simple auto clicker. Now, what is the purpose? So right now, before starting, you go to the settings options and disable the marches. So allow the world map, art resources, castle, resource spots, monsters and relic to cover the march route. Now, why do we need this? Because if you are doing some auto clicking, your click will end up landing on your march and that will ruin everything. So don't let that happen to you. Once you are done with this, everything is ready. Step number two is prepare your plan. So what I want to do right now is first I will min zoom out completely. Then come to the keep right here. This is the keep. Now what I want to do is I want to use all of these blessings. Right. Now, if I want to use these blessings, 6, 25, 11, 14, it is going to take me hours and hours of work to do this. And I don't have the patience to do it. So this is how I'm going to do it. Bring my key to the center. Click on it once. All right. So this is where my first click is going to be. So I go to the auto clicker. I set the timer as two seconds is fine. Enable new configuration. So the first click is on the city. Alright, so you press plus, it will give you a number, it goes on the city, correct? Now the second click is on the blessing. You bring it to the blessing. Once you go to the blessing, the third click is right here on the item. Once you hit that, the fourth click goes to confirm and done right now the fifth click is outside now you have to be very careful where you are placing this if you place it on the chat or anywhere you place it that is up to you but do not place it here exactly in the center so i just placed it outside so one click outside and it is gone now from the last click actually not the last click but the fourth click i'm going to increase the delay i'm going to make it four seconds now why did i make it four seconds very simple so i'll show you this manually click number one click number two click number three click number four it takes few seconds of delay for the rewards to pop up and then the click number five now i've done this i have set it up i'm just going to go to the settings i'll rename this as using blessings all right i will save it now let's see how many blessings do we have to use so I click here. So how many blessings do I have? I have got 5 plus 24 that is 29. 29 plus 11 that is 40. 40 plus 14 that is 54. So I come over here in the settings number of cycles I can write it 54. Now I just want to do it for 3 times or maybe 5 times. Okay. So I have written it as 5. I bring this down here. Okay. You ready? Play. Click. I'll go to the blessing. I'll click on the blessing. Confirm. Hit it. Click somewhere outside for once in 4 seconds break. And then it will go on and on. Click. Blessing. There you go. Now, you have to decide how to use this. This was just one technique I showed you. All these are repetitive monotonous steps. 
let me tell you people have tried to use auto clicker to you join boss rallies avoid doing it you might end up joining uh, pvp rallies and get unbubbled like if somebody is ghosting during svs or you never know somebody could be ghosting right in the middle of a normal day to scout somebody and you will end up joining that rally so just for your knowledge and understanding check before doing anything okay double test it like double check it 10 times before you know completely doing it blindly now once it is done with five times it will automatically pause and you come back to the same screen now i'll just save it let me show you one more uh, which is uh, wheel of fortune actually you don't really need to see wheel of fortune it's just one single click it keeps spamming it relics is good yeah so relics took me a good time to design the relics auto clicker so if i want to finish a relic i just have to go to the relic choose what i want and i'll hit the play button it will automatically smash all the relics all the relics it took me like what half an hour 45 minutes to make this but totally worth it uh, i would just simply open up a relic click on the auto clicker let it do the smashing work and i'll just go sit finish my thing maybe check back in a 2 minute time sometimes it would keep clicking around here and there so i would start it by being inside the city and not being outside the city because it might end up scouting somebody and dropping a bubble so i'm normally inside the city when i'm doing the auto clicker for what do we say relics but again there are auto clickers designing that you can do i'm not sure if it is uh, kept as illegal or against any rule i don't think so but it is what it is well everybody thank you for tuning in this is max from server 133 signing out i'll see you next time in a new video